Hello YouTube, this is a pickup video for October the 6th, 2012. <laughs> um, I double check my date for a second. And 6 is a magic number because sitting next to me in a pile right here are 6 PSP games that I picked up today from GameStop. Also had a very interesting adventure to help trying to help out a friend of mine on YouTube about trying to get a code for a game that he had pre-ordered. And no, right now currently we do not know the status of how that worked out. But anyways, <clears throat> here are the six games. And by the way, when I mention at least one of the games, if anybody knows anything about it, please leave it in the comments. Thank you. And I'm going to tell you this right now. The first three games are nothing to, you know, hoot and holler and cream yourself over, so I'm going to get those out of the way first. First one is the original Lumens for the PSP. Second one is its sequel, Lumens 2, and this one actually has its case. The only thing it doesn't have, actually it does, it comes with the game and the booklet. Whereas, in case anybody's curious, this one came with just the game, but I'm not that <clears throat> overly anal about that. Game number three is Hot Shots Tennis. Get a grip for the PSP. And so far, I know we're pretty much going. <sighs> Don't worry, I'm about to wake you up, I think. Because the next three are in the RPG realm, and again, if anybody knows anything about these games allowed, please then speak up. Ready? The first game, and this one is the one that really had me interested, and trust me, it was a good cheapie, too. It's like, according to the price here, about three bucks. The game is called, show it this way, Kingdom of Paradise for the PSP. I don't know anything about this game. Matter of fact, this is the one I, d I haven't played this one yet. I was just playing the original um, Lumens not that long ago. So, anyone knows anything about that game, by all means, don't hesitate. Next up is... Oh god, please I'm gonna, I know I'm gonna mispronounce this. Yggdra Union for the PSP from our good friends at Atlas. So we've got this one, Gun Getter, Atlas, and all three, excuse me, Persona games. Yeah, I'm a bit of an Atlas fan, in case you can't tell. And lastly, but certainly not least, let me double check myself here real quick. We have Wild Arms XF for the PlayStation Portable. Now, I'm going to let you know yes, I owned at one time Wild Arms 3 and Wild Arms 4 for the PlayStation 2. The one that I probably played the most, even though I didn't get very far in it, was Wild Arms 3. I'm probably going to get that game again at some point. But this is, in fact, XF, and one of, it's again one of these, if anybody can help me with this game, by all means, do so. Now, six games here. You might think we pretty, paid a pretty penny. We did it. We paid under, well actually no, I'm sorry, just a little bit over $25. Yeah. So I say I'm quite happy about that. Because there are some people in the gaming community that like to spend money on their games. And I have nothing, I have no issue with that. There are those of us that also like a good deal. 
like yours truly. This, by the way, now brings up the total number of PSP games to 10. Yeah, and I got news for you. With the way it's working down the GameStop, I might be bolstering that collection for quite some time. Especially with a lot of the games that are on that system. Anywho, that is the pickup video for this week, and or today anyway. And I shall talk to you later tonight. Because I might need some help if there's anybody out in uh, overseas that can help me with getting um, a download link to a Japanese PC game. Alrighty. Take care, and I shall talk to you later tonight. Bye-bye.